So in this video, we're going to see how the file history and the backup things going on. Um, this is my backup drive. Uh, if you remember my video here, uh, we set up the uh, backup uh, settings to one of my drive. Um, okay. And this one windows 10 backup and restore uh, so we set the <coughs> um, backup uh, for it to take uh, regular backups of my system uh, now we're gonna check how you can re uh, is it happening uh, is it taking regular backups uh, how they look like on the uh, drive itself are they like separate or just like you have the latest one um, or um, how to restore them so click on search oh sorry the start menu i think they call it start something now uh, and search for file history uh, you see this is the backup setting but we don't want that we want this one restore your files with file history we click on that and if i can show you so you see these are all the uh, backup um, not all one of them 17th one that was taken uh, about 12 or 11 38 this morning uh, so this is the button um, it's like a Windows media play or something I have to check I uh, just check the... so basically I haven't found anything that will <clears throat> change the layout here like if uh, I can see all of them together um, yeah so basically one by one you have to go and it shows the time here uh, you see uh, since that date has taken 17 of them uh, what, what you have to do is you go by the uh, right and left through these buttons right here and you check this one was taken 301 yesterday Christmas Day um, in the afternoon this one was 201 because it was set up for an hour interval then I changed it to once a day so you get the picture 10:30 uh, 38 a.m. basically when one hour the computer was on so it took uh, quite a few of them so what you do is for example if you wanted to um, back up from this one um, I'm not you can actually browse through and see if hey that's the file that I'm looking on and yeah it has so you can actually uh, open the file and see if uh, it has the data that you want it to uh, see and you can say okay it has the data up to the point that I want to um, ret retrieve uh, so you can go and then what you can do is actually I'm not sure um, like if, if an individual file can be restored probably it can be if I open this file and then restore I haven't tried it yet um, so uh, we can try actually um, so all you have to do is just click this button so rest it will restore this file to etch its original location for example if I don't want to uh, restore any of these files just this file I can delete it and restore it from here um, so that's how it will be done uh, or for all of them you can select all of them and then hit restore so all this file will be restored this is how you use the file history it's very easy you just have to go right and left through these uh, <coughs> um, buttons and one by one you see the time you can check the file open it and then that's how you do it uh, if you like this video please rate comment share and subscribe and you have a good day. See you in the next video.